my approach to music videos and the reason that I got into shooting moving pictures was really just that is to I've, I've always tried to have an emphasis on kind of a moving portrait the shape the color of the feel is a not only is it a musical album that, that Kay Tucker and her band are doing but it's become a large collaborative project with a lot of visual artists photographers filmmakers a lot of people have been given an opportunity to interpret the songs that are on this record into photographs and music videos and short films. I was so honored that he contacted me in the first place before this project had even been, you know, thought up and asked if um, he could shoot me. I was like, absolutely, but we didn't really ever have occasion to make that happen. And then I thought, well, what happens if he shoots me in a video? I'd seen the Kickstarter campaign and Kate had uh, emailed me a couple of times about it and we had attempted to meet. Mm -hmm. But I, then once I asked him to be part of the project, I didn't know if he was act, he was going to ask me to be in it or not. Because that's the other thing is we give these songs to these people and then they can decide who they want to put in the video. We don't have to be featured. I shot it in my photography studio. Uh, it was so simple because it wasn't the band, it was just myself and then Gabrielle Saliba was the dancer. And she came up with perfect moves and a perfect dance. Um, throughout. <laughs> I had no idea what was going on and, and that's part of this project, I think the beautiful um, terror that it is, that, I, that you just go in and, and let artists like Joshua set it up and kind of see it in their way and so, um, and actually it was really um, cathartic for me because it's a song that's very close to me. I've, I've always tried to have an emphasis on honesty and this song in particular I think it was so easy for me to envision it um, as as a moving portrait. I had mentioned to Kate weeks before, <clears throat> I had asked her, and it wasn't a joke question, but I had asked, can she cry on demand? And she said, why, well, I, I think so, I think I can. <laughs> I and, had no uh, idea, but I was like, I might as well say yes. <laughs> and, and so, it, great, it was like the elements that I needed, which was a, the, a very abstract element of being a, a person dancing behind her, um, and then her very stark um, and then I was hoping that she would be able to uh, cry on demand when I said go. He didn't really present a treat night and he asked, like he said, if I could cry on demand. And I didn't know, if, I thought that was a joke a little bit. And we started rolling uh, and she started crying. So uh, <laughs> after the first take, I, I, <laughs> after the first take, I was like, that was amazing. I didn't mean for you to start crying right off the bat. But, <laughs> Um, you know, it, as long as you can keep doing it. I had wanted to make portraits of Kate anyways, and I think I just found a good opportunity um, where I think that the song lent itself to, to being shot that way, and um, I, I got what I had originally wanted, which was being able to make portraits of her, and I just made the move this time. This time.